Well, in the timeout, Coach Mag said, or actually it was Coach B, he said we are going to run Boston, and it was a play that we actually just put in the practice before. Um, we ran it successfully a couple of times, so we were excited. Um, 12 seconds left. Um, we practiced it with only seven seconds, so she said we got to slow it down a little bit. She said, Kelsey, once you get the ball, she's like, try to wait until you have three seconds left to really get a shot off so they can't come back and get another shot. We, we went over it a few times, and every time we had Kelsey run it for the last shot. And uh, we ran it so many times that I just made her make sure she made the shot a few times. And, uh, you know, so I think the kids were actually pretty calm. We knew what we were going to do. Perfect situation. There was just a, a couple extra seconds than what we practiced. And uh, I really give Ariel Gaston some you know, major props because she, she looked at the clock. There was five more seconds than what we practiced, and she dribbled around a few more seconds. And, but, I mean, that shot Kelsey hit was a really tough shot. I mean, the kid was right in her face. She was fading away. Um, but, hey, Kelsey Hogan has won so many games. I mean, I know I've only been here for three years, but the amount of games that she's won at the buzzer already, she's just such an amazing little player. I got the pass from Arielle. Um, I saw there's maybe there was, I think, maybe five or something. So I crossed over, looked at Coach uh, Mags on the bench, and there was 3.5. And she goes, you got to go, you got to go. Um, and I tried taking the best shot that I could. And I can't even believe that it went in. It was unbelie uh, and unbelievable. And she said, Coach, you didn't seem that excited, really. You know, all the kids are. I said, yeah, Kelsey, I don't know. You've, you've hit so many of those. I just kind of take it for granted, I guess. I knew it was going in, you know, but um, we just never know, too. They have to check the, the clock and make sure that, they, that it went through. But you know what? It's just one of those games. We were on the other end of the stick last year where we lost a tough, tough, heartbreaking loss. And now, you know, we're on the other side of it. <clears throat> Excuse me. And uh, I'm just so proud of our girls. It's it was the best feeling ever. Like I I could feel like it was going in. And then once once I saw it go right through the nets, I just broke down. I, I love this team so much and we deserve to go and give um, Albany a run for their money again and I'm so excited for that game. So it was a uh, very emotional for me definitely.